Hi, my name is Casey Estwick and I'm a nomad visual artist from Barbados. I've basically spent the last year and about two months traveling the globe, most notably like the last four countries were in Africa. But I am back now and I'm super excited to be ready for the crop over season. Crop over is significant to me because it's the time in Barbados when everybody's so happy. Everybody's, you know, they come together, we party together as a people. And it's such an important part of our culture. I think we listen to our own music, um, we jump up to our own designers. It's just a celebration of Barbadian people. Um, I'm looking forward to wearing some local designers. And to be honest, since my travels, if it's one thing that I've noticed is nobody parties like Bajans. Like absolutely nobody. So I'm ready to just shell down the place again. So I have a selection of local designers here. Um, we have Aola. She has the most beautiful bags. I love that she chose to use natural fibers because I'm a sucker for natural fibers. And then we have Laverne. Uh, Melanie just knows how to create like the perfect feminine pieces. I love yellow. I think yellow is going to be beautiful on my skin. And then we have Makiba. I did a shoot for Makiba once and this dress was my absolute fave. It fits like a dream and I've never seen crochet this meticulous. It's just absolutely stunning work. And we have loyalty and brotherhood. The pieces are so dope if you're looking for anything like just fresh and funky. You can always like tap into loyalty and brotherhood. And over here we have Pauline. It's kind of unique, which is what I love about it. You know, it has a little bit of skin showing, which I always love. And I'm excited to kind of fit that and see what that looks like. And we have a little bit of rich couture. You could always use a nice little leather piece in your um, closet. It's super sexy and I love how bold the, the text is down here. He's like, I'm rich and I'm putting it there. And I have this lovely piece from Coco de Mer, which is a collaborative brand between Sugar Apple and Nikki Beads. Sugar Apple being a brand that I absolutely adore. The pieces are very earthy and flowy. There's a lot of linen perfect for like a little breakfast party. Super excited to get some more pieces from them. Okay, so these are a few of my pieces that I pulled from my closet that I intend to mix with a few of my favorite designers from the island. For Soko on the Hill, I'm thinking of maybe wearing this cute little black top with my Makiba button up, and then maybe I can pair those with this wide leg pants. And seeing that it's tipsy afterwards, then I could probably pair Aola bag along with this white top with that pant. I think that'd be very cute. For Scorch, I'm thinking maybe I could do this little mint dress with the loyalty and brotherhood blazer and then my mint slippers. I think it's very sexy. And for the UV breakfast party, maybe I can pair this sparkly top with the Coco de Mer shirt dress and the Converse just to make it look a little cute, more my style. And the rich couture skirt.